women who have experienced the pain of abortion look to courageous women. They look to them for comfort, healing, and example. I can think of no other woman of courage than Mother Teresa. She was a bold leader. You know, so often we hear about these women leaders and they're classified as leaders because of their liberal ideas. Mother Teresa was a genuine leader because of her faith and her humility. In the days ahead, Priests for Life will be offering a nine-day novena, calling upon Mother Teresa to intercede on our behalf and to take our message to Almighty God, imploring Him to come to our aid. I invite you now to pray with me the prayer to Mother Teresa. Father of life, you always defend the poor and oppressed. In Blessed Teresa of Calcutta, you raised up a voice for the voiceless and a friend to the poorest of the poor, the unborn child. She brought women away from the despair of abortion clinics to the hope of a loving community that cared for her and her child. She spoke the truth to men and women of power, asking them how we could tell people not to kill one another while allowing a mother to kill her own child. Father, as we honor this humble and faithful woman, we ask you to give us the grace to follow her example. May we be bold in word and generous in action to love and serve the unborn and to awaken our world to know as Mother Teresa said, that the greatest destroyer of love and peace is abortion. Fill us with love, bring us peace, and let us share your life forever. We pray through Christ our Lord. Amen.